PCR actually stands for polymerase chain reaction and it's a molecular biology technique that allows you to target a specific piece of the genome and amplify it, so to make many, many copies. The way this technology works is it takes a sample and breaks it up into 10 million droplets and then it reads each droplet individually to determine whether that droplet contains mutated DNA or normal DNA. So effectively you're looking for a needle in a haystack. What this system does is breaks up the haystack, looks at each piece of hay individually and says is this a needle or is this a piece of hay. The applications are, are many. We have chosen to focus our, our first product on um, rare allele detection for cancer. We have um, two collaborators in France that are renowned cancer researchers and they've not only helped us prove the uh, performance of the system but it's also given us a chance to start working with real clinical samples. What it means for researchers is they're going to be able to ask questions that they couldn't ask and answer before. Um, the ability to look at these rare mutations really will let them investigate the whole area of cancer and figure out which of these mutations really does play a part in the progression of the disease. The unique advantage of this new product is that it brings much greater levels of sensitivity to the field of DNA analysis than anything that previously existed. You have resolution down to very, very rare events you know, because some of the, the, um, the genes or the mutations that we're looking for in cancer are really only there in 1 in 10,000, 1 in 100,000. We're entering a new era of personalized medicine where researchers are gaining a much greater understanding of disease mechanisms and what the behavior of diseases are in each individual depending on their own uh, genetic makeup. This is a perfect example of the future made real.